I'm Alan Kinney, Editorial Director with REIT.com, and we're at the Win Las Vegas for REIT World 2015, NAIREIT's annual convention for all things REIT. I'm joined by Drew Alexander, President and CEO of Weingarten Realty. Now, Drew, you recently titled an investor presentation, Goodbye Kansas, Hello Hollywood. It's intriguing. Can you tell me what does that say about the company's strategy right now? Sure. We think it's an excellent tagline. It's memorable and it's also accurate. In 2011, we started a multi-year transformation, and over that period of time, we've sold a billion and a half dollars worth of properties, invested about 500 million, so we've obviously reduced leverage. And we want to focus on the core markets, on dense urban areas, so we've honed the geography where we're in markets where we have a strong presence with strong supermarket anchored centers. So again, we think it's a great tagline that is both memorable and accurate. Let's talk oil. Houston is your biggest market. What are you telling uh, investors right now who might have questions about uh, oil prices and energy prices? So we went public 1984-5 period. So we've been through lots of oil shocks, especially in the middle 80s when things were really bad. Houston lost 250,000 jobs. Houston over the last several years has added about 600,000 people to its population. So even though job growth the next year or two is going to be pretty modest, our properties are in a great position. The transformation not only applies to the whole company, but also to Houston. We've sold in whole or in part over 50 shopping centers in Houston, and today about 80% of our income in Houston comes from really strong centers that principally service super zips. So with the strong population, of the last several years, the strong population growth, very little new space being built. We're very comfortable. We'll weather this downturn just fine. And looking at your development program, can you tell us a little bit about uh, any markets you might be looking at and any targets you might set for the company? So one of the unique things about us is we're focused on the southern and western United States. We are coast to coast, but we're not across the entire nation. So we're active across our whole footprint, and we're currently developing properties in Seattle, Washington, and Washington, D.C. So we're happy to look at any of the markets that we're in. Just want a nice project in Atlanta. We're wrapping up a number of projects, and we think there's a good opportunity to selectively add new developments that are strong additions to the portfolio at, say, 100 150 to 200 basis point premium to what the exit cap rate would be. And we think with the relationships that we have, that makes for a good risk adjusted business for us. So we're cautiously optimistic we can add more good developments to our pipeline. Drew, always a pleasure. My pleasure. For more from REIT World 2015, check out REIT.com.